Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you some Hermit Crab life hacks, and, um, but right before we get into this video, I would just like to say that a lot of people have been commenting on my videos saying different things about, like, the Hermit Crab's digging, or, like, the Hermit Crab's, they're not sure if it's molting or if it's dead, or, like, if I could do, like, a Hermit Crab tank setup and things like that, and these are, a lot of the requests I'm getting are actually videos I have done like before so if you just scroll down a little bit on my channel a lot of these kind of videos that a lot of people have been asking for I've actually already done um so yeah I do already have like a hermit crab tank set up what my hermit crabs eat like what I feed them um about digging molting like all that kind of stuff as well the but I have seen someone just recently ask me about hermit crab breeding and that's one of the things about hermit crabs I'm not like super um good on like I don't really know that too much about hermit crab breeding because um usually hermit crabs don't breed in captivity I've only seen heard something about hermit crabs breeding twice in captivity so you may want to just google that one because um I have researched all of it like I know the people who had them breed it like had them breed it and what they did do but like I haven't personally like um gone through any of that myself and it's also super rare so I would say trying to like look into what people who have actually experienced that went through um other than asking me but yeah so anyway sorry this was kind of a long entry but intro but let's just go ahead and get right on into these hermit crab life hacks so the first life hack that i have um is for those people who want their hermit crabs to change into a new shell maybe if your hermit crab is too small for its old shell or if you just want it to try something new a way that you can always do is by putting um the shells um up like this so that they can and also making sure that there's like not really any sand in them so like kind of dump that out because the hermit crabs always like all my hermit crabs at least start picking the sand out before they can they change into the shell so it's good that to like just dump that out so that it'll make the process go faster and also this way they can see your hermit crabs can see the sizes and things and get in super easily because they change shells by going in just this way getting in and then flipping themselves over to walking around like they usually do and it just makes it much faster and also what you can do is you can put your shells into some water um, like a very shallow water in a little bin with the shells in there and her it's been said that hermit crabs change their shells um, faster sometimes if they are in water with nothing else but like the shells or something so yeah so that is the first life hack the next life hack is if you want your hermit crab to be a little more active, definitely get a light, and if you turn that on pretty often, um, it will start making them want to be more active and doing different things. And also, if you remodel your tank um, every so often, uh, that will also make your hermit crabs be more active because they do love to explore and it gives them something new to do. And also, if you make sure that you are giving them new foods and things to try, they love that too because they um, are scavengers that so they do like to try lots of new things and that will make them more active. Another life hack is if you notice that your hermit crabs aren't eating that often you should definitely try moving your food dish to a different spot maybe like since I do have a coconut here um, if my hermit crab say like my hermit crabs I noticed that they weren't eating as much or something since that their usual hideout is right here and the food dish is over here maybe try moving the food right here or just like kind of putting it next to them not even in a dish and then soon that will probably make them realize that they should go into their dish for food and also if you have smaller hermit crabs um like I also do have some smaller ones make sure that they can they are able to get into your hermit crab I meant into the food dish because I have a little bit of a taller food dish um so I always make sure I have things like these shells are right here or this bridge or even like they can still kind of uh climb up this anyway or like this little rock here they could use to help themselves get into it so you always need to make sure that your smaller hermit crabs are able to reach your food dish and yeah I do need to put some new food in my food dish too today so that reminds me to do that and yeah so let's go on to the next life hack another amazing life hack that will save you so much money is instead of always going to PetSmart or something like that to buy 
like things for your hermit crabs. PetSmart and like Petco and other pet stores are usually pretty expensive so I would definitely um, recommend like going onto Craigslist or those kind of apps and finding people near you or even just like on eBay or something that may have like I've a lot of people will do like hermit crab batch or something and then they'll have like a whole bunch of shells and like decorations and like a lot of things that you need for pretty cheap because you know there's always those people that just want to get rid of things even though the things are still in good condition and you can get it for much cheaper because PetSmart and Petco really do make their things their pet stuff pretty pricey and so if there's something that you want that you know you could probably get somewhere else besides PetSmart and Petco which is almost like all the time you can find anything any like at, in other places other than just PetSmart or Petco and then you should definitely try and check on eBay or something and it will definitely save you a lot of money because sometimes these things can be pretty expensive for your pets. And yeah, so I think those are going to be all the hermit crab life hacks I'm going to be saying um, in this video. However, if you want to see more of these, comment down below and give this video a like so I do know that you want to, you do want to see a part two. And yeah, so thank you all so much for watching. I hope that this kind of helped you out and gave you some ideas. And yeah, so thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye everyone.